Hey YouTube, so I got a 2010 Ford Focus here. I have another video of the rear shock replacement. Uh, so I also have a driver's side CV axle replacement. I'm going to show you how using a slide hammer and the special tool uh, that's required to pull this vehicle off. We're going to show you how to actually get this thing off since uh, it apparently causes a lot of problems for people. So here you can see I already have the disassembly done, have the knuckle out, have the axle partially out. But uh, without the tool and the flight hammer, it's not coming. So let's uh, move over and show you how that tool works on here. So there are two tools that you're gonna need to get this half shaft out. One is gonna be a slide hammer, threaded end, right? The other is gonna be this half shaft removal tool. Uh, this is a specialty tool. You're gonna have to probably find this before, uh, maybe eBay, Amazon. I hope you have this before you started taking your car apart. Uh, Cause you're not gonna get this half shaft out without this tool. It's going to end up going in over the back of the axle, and I'll show you in a second. You're going to thread this slide hammer in. You're going to need a second person to pull stuff out of the way uh, while you beat that half shaft out of there. That makes sense. So this tool, you're going to end up inserting it behind. This one we've already pulled out. You're going to insert this behind the axle between the case, and you're going to use that slide hammer to pull it out. Here's the insertion of the new axle. You want to grease the hell out of the end of that thing. Once you've got the uh, half shaft back in, it's just a matter of reassembling your hub. Might need a jack underneath it. Now it's just a matter of folding everything back up and you're done.